Okay, now, as you know, the good, the bad, and the ugly was on a little bit of a hiatus, but as you can see, there's been a couple of changes, starting with me not looking like Chad Kruger anymore. Hot. This week's good. No, that's it. That's the whole thing. That's the good. Austin Matthews has a tattoo now. It's hilarious. All right, for real, this week's good. Dana White, president of UFC, said that the fight between McGregor and Mayweather is finally going to happen, the impossible. McGregor in a boxing fight with a boxer. Now, I'm not exactly a fighting expert, although based on this photo, you, you might think differently. <laughs> but, but Mayweather is 49-0. and 0. McGregor does not give a bleep, as he would say. I put you in there, buddy. You're the boxing guy. I'm, I'm the boxing guy. Watch me take over boxing. Trust me on that. Floyd doesn't know. Not no one in this boxing game knows what's coming. Trust me on that. When I step in there, I'm going to shock the whole goddamn world. Trust me on that. This dude was collecting unemployment checks four years ago. His initial UFC fight, his first fight ever, was almost done on Facebook Live. Love him or hate him, he's brought a lot of personality to the UFC, and you're 100% probably likely to, that's my bet, going to watch this fight on August 26th. Bad, the Toronto Blue Jays bones. Now we did just get Tulo and Donaldson back, which is good, but then the baseball gods were like, oh my gosh, yes, this would be a good time to break Ezekiel Carrera's right foot. 10 day DL, here we come. What do they do, just have DL parties? Now 16 Blue Jays have missed at some point in the season. That's combined 478 games. What is it? They're just going down like bowling balls. My suggestion is that Jose Batista should join a Got Milk campaign so that their bones get stronger instead of this fun one. The good news is the boys are teetering on 500 baseball. Now, Steve Pierce will be back, and that's going to help a little bit. Oh, oh sorry. <laughs> that was me just looking for positivity. Ugly, Ricky Ray. No, 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 I'm not, I'm not saying he's ugly. This grandmother seems to think he's a heartthrob. He's the quarterback of the Argonauts. I, I apologize to Ricky Ray, to you and to the Toronto Argonauts. <laughs> Talk to me about Ricky Ray, is he handsome? He's getting older. What's wrong with that? Nothing with my case. <laughs> it's bad because I'm talking about how he's 37 years old and expected to play the first string quarterback role for the Toronto Argonauts. He played nine games last season. 2015, he had that broken something. 2016, he had that punctured lung and broken rib. My gosh, I'm not saying that he's not one of the greatest quarterbacks to play in the CFL. I'm saying that, Ricky, I'm worried about you worried about your health. Honestly, please just retire with Henry Burris and take Zumba classes together because that is hilarious. Well, if you like this video, you know what to do. Comment, like, subscribe, share, enjoy, comment. Well, nothing mean or something mean. I don't know. Bye. Enjoy your week.